hello viewers uh, today I'm going to show you how you can get uh, GPS data from an image for example uh, one of my friends uh, snap an image for instance this is the one I'm showing it uh, <coughs> this is the image that he shot uh, actually this is a view from my office anyways this is a test image and I want to know where this image was snapped from. So how you can do that? You can go to properties like this and go to details page and scroll down to uh, GPS uh, information. From here you can see latitude and longitude. If I want to know uh, the location where this latitude and longi longitude in the uh, map then uh, we can uh, we cannot get it because we cannot copy it I tried several ways but there is no way to get this data out from this property page that's why I was uh, seeking in the internet and uh, to find some uh, tools that that can be used to get this latitude and longitude but unfortunately I found some source codes um, instead any software so I made a software not software I can call this thing a tool in Visual Studio uh, I'll show you um, this is the I'm opening the Visual Studio this is the one and I want to open the project I'll give you a link of this um, uh, these um, tools so that you can use it in your program. So I'll open the project from here. I can GPS image. Don't worry. I'll give you a link of this project so that you can download it. And here, here is the code that I used to you use this function this is a, a standalone function you can you copy this uh, function and place in your code so that you can uh, get the GPS location here um, the path file name you will enter uh, the path file name in this function and this function will return uh, latitude and longitude with these two variables and if this function succeeds then it will uh, return true it should return false uh, if it fails but um, I didn't code that uh, one yet maybe uh, if I update this thing then I'll show you later so you can uh, copy this code uh, don't worry you don't need to type just right now because I'm going to give you the download link of this code so that you can uh, use it directly have uh, done downloading from planet source code so how you will use it in your program like this one you will create a form I have create, uh, created and uh, created a form here I go inside uh, you all may know this is a open file di dialog control uh, it calls open file dialog box and, and this uh, file name is has been thrown inside the function here and I did not use any return value I just need la latitude and longitude so I declared to double data type and pushed into my function so that my function can fill this latitude and longitude um, with, the, with the value from the image and this is the file name you will push uh, you will uh, push the file using uh, this uh, name into the function and it will return latitude, latitude longitude in these two variables and I populated this latitude and longitude into a text box this is a text box called TB GPS coordinate so here I populated this uh, latitude longitude is very big so I formatted this thing so that 
it will give only five digits I don't need more than five digits so I could cre I've created like this so I will run it when it runs it will show like this I'll click open picture and select this image click open and you can see this latitude and longitude is showing in a format so that you can uh, copy it and paste into Google Maps to get the proper location. So maybe I can show you uh, the photo properties. So this thing, this uh, latitude, longitude, and this thing are the same. This is not using any internet or anything. Um, so it will extract the GPS coordinate from the images. Uh, if you don't have any image with the GPS, uh, GPS data, maybe you can turn your uh, GPS, uh, GPS radio on and in your camera application you will, um, you will turn on that so that the camera can capture GPS data and store into your image. Maybe I'll explain this settings uh, in, in some later v uh, videos, but uh, I'm not going that part. I'm just mentioning that, that thing. So uh, this is the summary that these two latitude and longitude and this is, these are the same. Now I can copy it. As I cannot copy this uh, latitude and longitude, so I'll copy it from the tool that I've just created and I'll go to uh, maps.google.com uh, this is on my other screen I'll bring it here so like this maybe you have have some any other places I copied latitude longitude as you can see uh, like that um, okay just a second it does not showing maybe I'll do it again run it oh it's already running so where is it oh maybe this is the one open the picture and where is that image I don't um, I'll open that picture right now just a second I have a lot of uh, windows that's why it is uh, bit confusing for me now just a second again oh this is the one so I'll open open this one copy it copy and this to and paste it here and pay and search and the immediately you can see the location the where the image was uh, snapped so this is how you can make it or maybe you can use uh, arts.google.com and you can lo look at the uh, location where the image was snapped from and uh, you have to <coughs> understand that this uh, GPS coordinate uh, is not 100% accurate so um, if you can see this image is here uh, you cannot say th uh, the image was taken right on this place maybe it was uh, snapped uh, a couple of meters away and for the accuracy of the GPS it can show a bit different place but we can uh, we can <coughs> think that uh, this image was snapped in this area I hope you understand how uh, my tool works and uh, how you can get uh, GPS data extract from the image and use it to locate the image or if you need to use in your uh, software here is the program and I'll stop it and here is the function you copy it paste it in your e uh, software and use it and I'll be very happy if you uh, give me some credits uh, for making this thing and I'm also giving credit to uh, this uh, user who actually developed these tools from where I've uh, this one I should close this thing so 
I will paste it and here this is the user who have oh it is not showing here because I don't have any account on VB forums but I kept I got this thing from this page uh, you can see sustain blue sustain blue he was uh, uh, asking for a solution and later on uh, sustain blue uh, succeeded uh, with uh, this code and this one was formatted in a, into a form and uh, very hard to use but I uh, used this code and put in into a standalone function so that uh, it can be used very easily uh, I hope you understand um, the proper way how you can use this function and how you will get GPS data from the image. Um, I hope um, this video will be useful for you. If you use it in your code, then please give me some credits. And thank you for watching this video. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, I should not finish it right now because I want to uh, show you where you will download this uh, video from. So this is the page. Uh, if you go to Planet Source Code and uh, DS Sanahira, my name is. Uh, this is my name. Maybe I've brought a wrong page. Click. Um, this is this is my profile at uh, Planet Source Code. You can get this source code from. Oops, not this one. So I'll open it. So this is the location you can copy this address and you can get the same source code you will hit this download code and you can uh, you will be able to download to use in your program I'll uh, you don't need to type this address because I'm going to add this uh, address in the description box I hope uh, this code will be uh, useful for you and I hope uh, you will use it and it will be useful for you and thanks again for watching this video I hope I'll come up with something uh, new later on till then have a very nice day